Hello everyone, I'm Cheldon Barlett Rumor and this is it. Welcome back to This Is It TV. Happy Monday, Taquan. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. We are meeting amazing friends that are bringing us and our friends some new treats. <laughs> I would love for her to introduce herself, first and last name, and the name of her business. Hi. I'm Melmo's Dog Treats. I am Melissa Morales. I am the owner. Um, we're a woman-owned, uh, woman-owned and operated business uh, out of Philadelphia. I am obsessed. I'm obsessed. <laughs> How long have you been doing this? About two and a half years. Two and a half years. Now, yeah. I'm assuming you love dogs. I love dogs. I'm assuming. <laughs> cats too. Cats, cats too. too. Cats too. I'm assuming you Absolutely. love pets in general. Now, what made you decide that this was a business that you had to start? Um, I kind of fell into this business. Really? I, I really did. Wow. Um, I, was, I was running an organic pizza shop, and uh, all my customers that. had dogs, and um, they wanted a better treat. Yeah. And uh, the ones we were getting were really expensive. Yes. The dogs didn't like them. Right. So I thought, I wonder if I could do this. One, I one, they were expensive, and the dogs didn't like them. And the dogs didn't like them. <laughs> so you're spending all, so, these yeah. monies on, all this money on treats, right. and the dogs don't like them anyway. Right. Oh, okay. Fair so, enough. So we're going to make them better for them, and we're going to make th sure that they're delicious for the dog, absolutely. and we're going to make them at a good price? You're going to make them at a good price. You're going to locally source. Wow. You're going to make them... They're, they're, they're people tested. They're dog approved. They yes. are. We eat everything that we make. Stop. Um, yeah, absolutely. Oh. You could dip these in your coffee and have them. Tease me not. <laughs> she said coffee. And she said, oh, treat. No, coffee. Right. Coffee, it's, coffee and biscuits. Coffee are and biscuits is an absolute must. So everything Absolutely. that's in here is Absolutely. something that you and I could eat. Absolutely. Really? You can count on one hand how many different ingredients are in my biscuits. Really? Now, why was that so important for you? Because that is a unique thing, especially within the food, the dog food, pet food scenario. There's so many different things, not only chemicals, but yeah. just things you can't even pronounce. Why Absolutely. was it important for you to keep it simple? Um, for me, it has, I mean, why would you give your dog something you wouldn't be willing to eat? That's so simplistically true. I mean, true. They're, they're your family. They're part of your family. And wow. their only flaw is that they don't live long enough. But why not why? give them the best thing you could possibly give them to eat? The simplicity so. nature of it is just it's, such a beautiful. Yeah. And it could, Simple ingredients, yeah. locally sourced, you know, support small business, yeah. be small business. I love that. Talk to me about the locally sourced, too. I mean, that sounds like something you mentioned it a couple times, so it sounds like something that's really, really important to you. Well, I mean, the fact that I have the Italian market yeah. right here uh, <laughs> makes it, you know, uh, ridiculously easy. But, yeah. I mean, we, we do Swarthmore Farmer's Markets, Bedminster, Bristol. Hey, Bristol. We really? love Bristol. Uh, Bristol <laughs> Farmer's Markets, Tinicum. Tinicum has been really good to us. Yeah. So, I mean, there's just a, a, a plethora of, of, of things so yeah. close, so many hardworking folks. Yes. Um, and, and just support business supporting small business yeah. and they you know so everybody in the community has been really awesome we were just featured in philly Rojo magazine Yay! um we love so, them we yeah. love them i think it's so important i mean you're hitting all of the major benchmarks <laughs> obviously it's it's great it's affordable you're definitely focused on supporting the local businesses that are in and around so, talk so to me about important. the options talk to me about what types of things we can find options yes five, five different flavors soon really? to be six um i'm working yourself busy yeah absolutely <laughs> well I've, I've got a host of vets i keep on speed dial i'm working yeah. on a urinary tract friendly biscuit as we speak really um something yeah, yeah. something really good I want it has to it has to be affordable yeah but, you know what i mean yeah i'm, I'm constantly running right money. exactly it's be affordable exactly um, and and for people to buy something yeah. from a small business, it has to be affordable. Yeah, no, so, I agree. I agree. You know, Ten dollars a pound, six dollars for half a pound. I do doggy birthday cakes, what? Like puff cakes, pop pops, you name it, we do it. Oh, I love um, that. All of the icing is is quite simply tapioca starch and just like one drop of like an edible airbrush dye that just really brings the color out. Oh my it's, gosh. You know, I mean stuff you would eat. Yeah. Stuff you would want to eat. So responsible. Yeah. I mean and I think that you were mentioning again, you said urinary tract, like so yeah. you are not only making sure that they're happy, but that, that they're but healthy. But they're healthy, I absolutely. And for me, a lot of the different recipes that have come about have been because, you know, my dog can't eat wheat, my dog can't eat chicken, my yeah. dog can't eat... So I really cater to the people that, that have specialized diet yeah. dogs. Yeah. Wow. So, they, I feel yeah. like those dogs it's, are it's, spoiled. <laughs> they are. And, they are. And we are too by yeah. having you on oh, the thank show. You. Thank you so much <laughs> for joining us. I want to make sure that everybody can get their hands on these <laughs> treats, whether it be for themselves or for their <laughs> special pet within their lives. If people want to get in touch with you, if they want to follow, fan, and like you, where would they find more information about your business? Melmosdogtreats.com. I have a Facebook page, Melmosdogtreats. Uh, Instagram, of course, at Melmosdog. 
Uh, hashtag Biscuit King of Philly. I love that. Okay, well then we need something from the Biscuit King <laughs> to Quan. I think that now we are in the know. We suggest that all of you get in the know as well. Thanks so much for joining Thank me. Thank you. Oh my gosh, so wonderful from all of us here at This Is It TV. I'm Cheldon Barlett Rumor, and we'll see you soon. Take care.